Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I am bringing you another Hunter build. Now, I've made these videos pretty much the last three uploads, have done really well. You guys seem to love these builds. I will be making a Warlock and a Titan build very soon, so stay tuned for that. But in today's video, I'm going to be showing you probably the best Hunter build that you can get for DPS. If you guys are doing the raid, this build is going to be insane. Just for damage wise, it deals some absolutely insane numbers. I'll leave a link in the description to the dim link for this build. But with that said, let's jump straight into it. Massive shout out to DVing for sponsoring today's video. If you guys are looking for anything Destiny 2 related, this is a website to check out, especially with Final Shape just releasing. There's a lot of good offers on at the minute i'll leave a link in the description for you guys to check out also it will not get you banned as they use sherp services to get your items and if you guys do use unstoppable at checkout you will in fact get a 15 percent discount so definitely use that and there'll be a link down below so starting off with the prismatic hunter we are using the golden gun marksman make sure you have this on because it is what makes a build super good for dps we then have the standard obviously two transcendents then abilities we have gambler's dodge triple jump combination blow and grapple probably the best two you can combine so far then we do have winter shroud with the stylist executioner for your fragments we have Facet of Balance, Facet of Protection, Facet of Courage, Facet of Dawn, and Facet of Purpose. So make sure you are running them. That is a prismatic build. Weapon wise, we have to discuss this because it is what makes the build insane. It is the new exotic still hunt. Now, if you guys haven't seen how powerful this thing actually is, it's crazy. It is an energy weapon, it's more like a heavy weapon, to be honest. As you can see, its intrinsic traits are pick up orbs of power or land precision shot to charge this weapon super bar. Once full, press the reload button or hold it down to fire golden gunshots. That's correct. This weapon fires golden gunshots when you charge it, and it's not that hard to charge. So the amount of damage you can actually deal just from using this weapon is insane. But then if you guys pair it with as we all know, the Celestial Nighthawk, it can deal some absolutely insane damage, I'm not going to lie. We have paired that up with the Harmonic Siphon, Dynamo and Hands-On. And if you guys are new to the game, I'll talk you through the Celestial. Precision Final Blows reduce the cooldown of your super, modifies the Golden Gun to fire a single high damage shot. Targets defeated by that shot give you super energy and explode. So pretty much we run running the highest DPS super we can use and the highest DPS sniper you can use. You can even pair it with a rocket with obviously the fast swap if you guys do want to do the extra damage. But trust me, it's not even needed with this certain build. Moving on to the arms, what we do have is a recovery mod, fastball, firepower and bolstering detonation. Then we do have, to increase it even more, we have a recovery mod, harmonic resistance and solar resistance right there. Moving on to the boots, we do have a resilience mod, insulation, recuperation and solar weapon surge. As you can see, your solar weapon gain a small bonus to damage. So if we have an armor charge, the sniper is going to deal even more damage, which is insane. Make sure you have that on. Then we do in fact have recovery mod, reaper and time dilation so that we do have the armor charge for a little bit longer. Build wise doesn't really matter, just have decent resilience and anything else doesn't really matter as we are running this build for the simply the DPS purpose. Now I'll show you right now how much DPS this thing can actually do in game. But if you are new to the channel make sure to leave a like for the fastest builds on Destiny 2 straight to the point and I'll leave you with the gameplay right now. 